Hi there. I do not know with what to begin this letter, but I have difficulties. I was going to buy tickets today, but I cannot be registered at customs. Do not allow me to leave Russia for the reason, lack of necessary means. The matter is that for foreign citizens, which cross border, there are indispensable conditions to have at itself or on personal account, the necessary sum of money. It is material insurance. Today, when to me sounded, this sum, I lost a speech power. Generally, me, it is necessary to have at itself $1,800 at the rate of $60 in day for 30 days that I could to be solvent in your country. It is necessary for this purpose whatever to be poor and to manage to take care of itself. On the other hand, it is the correct requirements as without money in others country, there is nothing to do. But I did not know that I have to have the sum for 30 days at me is money, but I have only $500, which I plan to take with myself in the USA. And I did not think that I will be late for 30 days. And of course I knew that I have a beloved which to take care of me. I know that at me is you and I will be the welcome guest, which will always feed me and will give a lodging for the night. Also will not give to spend the night under the bridge. Therefore, I was quiet in it. I tried today to explain all this to the customs officer. All understand that it is severe requirements, but can help nothing to me, as there are such rules, and it is thought up not by me, and it is thought up, the governments of our countries, in general, for Russia, there are strict requirements, perhaps, it is connected, with the latest events in the world, because we have problems in the relations, between the countries, I do not know with what it is connected, and how long, it began, Kenneth, my dear, entrance, according to my visa, is allowed, but for, the first 30 days, I have to have $1,800, a material covering, for the term of stay, in foreign state, what to can, support itself in the USA, I correctly understood, it is a living wage, initially, for the tourist who enters the USA, well, everything is so difficult, and it, of course me all very much, exhausts, now, there is a new problem which needs to be solved, without these a condition, I cannot be registered, and me do not put the visa in the passport, as for a visa stamp, it is necessary to have plane tickets, therefore, I cannot fly up today, and I had to act from flight, when, on an extent, all way, constantly, you have barriers, gradually, hands fall, and my health, very strongly, is suppressed, as I, very much counted, to meet you, I strongly want to you, and I want to see you, very much, and to get acquainted, with you, in reality, and to begin our relations, on the other hand, in real life, to have excellent time together, to have excellent holidays together, and of course, at this moment, I have a big desire, to begin to cry, and of course, you do not want to live, such minutes, when, before you, lay down such conditions, for me, it is a big problem, my dear, I now plan, to contact the house, to ring round parents and friends, to try to borrow, at someone, but I do not think that I will take this money in short terms, as, I already have almost to all, I have many expenditure, with this trip, and I already took from friends and parents, for this trip, I am not the rich person, and at me is not present, a rich family and friends, even having, my $500, I do not have $1,300, and it, now big money, what to collect it quickly, I do not know, where to take them, in this situation, I would not refuse your help, as for all the time of my documents, your help is necessary to me, more than ever, but I, of course, understand that it is big money, and for you, but I will return them to you back, you do not think, that I, will spend, or to pay someone, these $1,800, it is necessary to show simply, as entrance ticket, as check, what to prove that I have them, at myself, what to prove that I have money, that I would be passed, at customs, have to be convinced that it me is, the necessary sum, and that I get into the plane, with cash, then I, will return them, you at once, on an arrival in the USA, when you meet me at the airport, I will give them, you back, your $1,300, it is formality, it is the temporary loan, and this sum is obligatory financial insurance, I need to show them to the authorities only, as soon as I convince the authorities, that I have money, they register me on flight, I fly up, 
and when landing, I give this money back to you. You understand? I very much want to find the solution, as it is important for me. For us, I think what exactly from this meeting, we could begin, other future, together, and you do not represent as I want to arrive to you, and to see you, and I am sure that you do want, I feel it, and of course, I very much am afraid to lose you, as, this event, became bad, right at the end, but if I had, this money, I of course would not endure that, but I do not know what to do now, I am very strongly shaken, as I have number $1300 which ask from me, at present, I do not know what to write. I tried to describe most in detail, this situation, I think that I will leave, this letter, also I will wait for your answer, I hope, tonight, to read you, I you, always kiss, always your Elena. Hi my soon to be wife Elena. I'm so sorry to hear that you are running into difficulties with the process. I wish they could make it much easier and you could travel freely. We really have no choice but to comply with the regulations and you have the $1,800 in hand when you arrive at customs. I talked to Uncle Bart and he is willing to loan you the $1,300 as long as you promise to give him a big hug when you come from customs. What do we need to do on our end? We await your letter and how we can help you with the $1,300 United States dollars. If you are scared and need to talk, here again is my phone number, 402-370-6188. Hugs and smooches, Kenneth. My dear, I rang round now many acquaintances and relatives, what to borrow a little money, but anybody unfortunately has no such sum at present. The father with mother have also no. They are the old people living on modest pension. I do not know what to do. I have a panic, but if you and your uncle, I can help me. It would solve problems. Tell the uncle that I will bring this money with myself. I spend nothing. I only have to have them at myself. What to confirm that I am the solvent tourist, and not the not legal migrant. As soon as I land at the Minneapolis airport, I will give all its money back. Thus it is the easy loan, all for a couple of days. You ask me how to transfer money, but I do not know, can be by mail. I tried to call you on number 402-370-6188 several times, but every time I am answered that number cannot be available or it is disconnected. I have to call gathering so, plus one, four zero two, three seven zero, six one eight eight. I am right plus one code of the USA. I wait for the answer. I will be in cafe in an hour. If it is not closed, I kiss Elena. My dear in Moscow 2321, and already late very much, I came to cafe, what to give the latest news, as the cafe will be closed soon, from you there is no letter, but I want to wish you good day, tomorrow Friday, therefore if I do not fly up to you tomorrow, I risk to get stuck here for the weekend, and I very much would not want it, I now in cafe, I am going to drink a cup of tea, the cafe works till midnight, suddenly you will write during this time, if not, I you kiss that, you're Ellen. Hi Elena. Sorry for the delay in writing, we were at the pool sunbathing. My phone number is active, just leave your name and it will connect you, please try again. My dear, do you have Western Union or MoneyGram there? We can transfer that way I think. I've never done it, but know of it. Please write us back very soon, we want you to get on a plane for the weekend. Talk to you very soon. Love you. Kenneth.